A lot of people are wondering, yeah, are those stories true? Yeah, they're real. First of all, that's why I have them on the show, so people can say, oh, there is an actual Martine. <laughs> Hell yeah, he's very real. Look at him, you can't fake that. <laughs> Hell no, man. But uh, just so you guys know, all the stories that you guys have heard in the past from my specials are all very true, from Martin to my buddies going down the Disneyland ride to my son, Frankie. You know, some of you actually question that when I'm at the malls or at airport. Do you really have a son named Frankie? I really do. You know, he's 13 years old. He looks exactly like me. And why is that strange? Because I've only had him for four years. <laughs> He's technically my stepson, but I don't like to call him that because then automatically it feels like I'm trying to be detached, you know? He's mine. Plus, he looks, like I said, exactly like me. And I figured with time, he'd grow and stretch and start to look different, but he's just taller, you know? I have friends who I haven't seen in years come over the house and they see him and they freak out. They're like, dude, when did you find time to have a kid? And I'm like, I just got him. Like, he looks just like you. I go, not bad for aftermarket, huh? <laughs> go, he's a certified pre-owned. Yes, he is, yes, he is. Look at the stomach, look at the stomach, look at the stomach, look at the stomach. <laughs> Hercules, 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 Hercules. Good kid. And I tried to adopt him. Tried. But then I come to find out my girl didn't have sole custody, so I had to get a lawyer. And then the lawyer says, are you this serious about, you know, about Frankie? And I said, yes, I am. He says, well, Gabriel, the easiest thing for you to do is get married. I'm like, are you serious? <laughs> I'm gonna get married? And my lawyer, who I'm paying, got mad at me. You mean to tell me you are willing to adopt her son, but you're not willing to get married? I'm like, dude, I'm always gonna like him. <laughs> I think that's funny, because there's a lot of you clapping, but there's some of you that are nervous, like, I wanna clap, but... <laughs> She's right there. <laughs> Still real. And then of course I get people asking me, well, okay, all right, you have a son. Do you ever think about expanding your family, you know? All the time, it's just that right now, you guys, I'm working a lot. And it's not to say that, you know, there, there hasn't been possibilities, because I've had a couple scares, you know? And ladies, <laughs> ladies, I'll let you know right now, if you ever think that you might be pregnant, don't do what my girl did to me, you know? It's 2 a.m. I'm already asleep and she's complaining. I'm so nauseous, I don't feel good. And I wake up, you okay? I think I'm pregnant. <laughs> good night. And she rolls over. <laughs> hey! What? I go, we gotta find out. Well, what are you gonna do? 24 hour Walgreens, that's what we're gonna do. I get inside of Walgreens, I don't even have a clue as to where to find a pregnancy test. I'm looking at all the aisles. They don't have one that says, oops. <laughs> you know, so I start going up and down, up and down, trying to find a pregnancy test. And then I find one, right? I'm reading it. And as I'm reading it, I started noticing all the other products that were next to it. And I come to find something out. And that is that Walgreens, Rite Aid, CVS, and Walmart have all figured out the evolution of life. And they grabbed all the products that are necessary for a, a life and they stuck them in one aisle and they put them in order according to how you mess up. <laughs> and some of you actually know what I'm talking about. But the next time you go to one of those stores and you see that aisle I'm talking about, you're gonna laugh your ass off because you're gonna think of me and you're gonna be like, <laughs> you know, people are gonna be like, what's, what's so funny? Oh my God, Fluffy. <laughs> Because you are going to see exactly what I saw, the evolution of life. As soon as you turn the corner, first thing you're going to see, condoms. Next to that, lubricant. Next to that, pregnancy test. Next to that, pampers. Next to that, formula. And at the end of the aisle, they sell beer. 